whiskey, whiskey makes my baby feel a little frisky. Back roads are bogging up, my buddies pile up in my truck. We hunt our honeys down, we take them into town. And I'm Tom Russo. And this is the Rebel Report. Today's Thursday, April 26th. It is day seven, and we start with period three this morning. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may now be seated. This is a reminder that all students that participated in yesterday's EPP testing should once again report to the cafeteria immediately following announcements. Students may use a calculator today, so please make sure to bring your own. Prom tickets are on sale all this week and next week during lunch block in the cafeteria. The last day to buy tickets will be Friday, May 4th. There will be a photography club meeting today in room 215 in room 2302. And are you a senior going to college to study urban planning topics like land use planning or transportation issues? If yes, there's a scholarship opportunity through the Metropolitan Area Planning Council, which is due May 11th. Interested? See Mrs. McCann in the school counseling office today. That's all for me. Now over to Tom with some more announcements. Thanks, Ava. The WHS Marching Band is adding a color guard. Students interested in learning more about this creative opportunity should come to the information session on Monday, May 7th at 2.05. For more information, please see Mr. Gable in the music office, room 1102. Attention everyone who traveled to the Dominican Republic over spring break. We'll have our final ma mandatory meeting on Tuesday, May 1st in room 2214, directly after last class. The student, the student SOS boxes now have an online version that can be used anonymously. If you have concerns for a friend and want to get them help, you can call up the Walpole High website. From there, click on the student tab and scroll down to the bottom to the SOS link. This opens a form you can fill out that will be seen by the school psychologist. It is a completely anonymous way to, for you to help your friend. He once won a staring contest with his own reflection. It's time for Words of Wisdom with Javon Jackson. William. Fedo was a printer and author in the 1920s. He isn't well known today, but he told me something back when we were working together in an old print shop. He said, one way to get the most out of life is to look upon it as an adventure. That is still true today as it was 100 years ago. Back to the desk. That's all for the news, Wubble High. Have a great day and stand by for Ambush News. Can you cry underwater? Cry underwater? Yeah. I don't think.